This Wrong. might have been how it started. You stood up to you educate and pain. If we don't elect you, we'd be insane. There were people from all walks of life, rich, poor, young and old, who were fed up with both parties and politics as usual. They were among the first to call for taking the country back. Still, many folks turned away, while the media simply made fun. If you pull up articles on you consistently, you'll see, on occasion, but, but consistently, there are a lot of people who describe you as a flake. I'm impressed that you dare to enter Ron Paul world. Good for you. What is this about? Who are his fans? Oh, man, they're crazy. I, then they're not just on the Internet. They show up to see him speak. And show up they did. From Internet money bombs to declaring a Ron Paul revolution. A movement much stronger than the media message behind it. The charade of the media in the United States can only go so far in denying reality from the American people. And that reality was harsh. So you're saying as a result of this, a bigger economic crisis is coming? Yeah, I think we're in the midst of one. And it was precisely that crisis that finally got the press to pay attention. Because when talking points no longer fix the problem, Ron Paul's alternative, outspoken views, offered a concrete solution. And that's why this... Congressman Paul, welcome to Bloomberg. With his always unique and outspoken point of view, Congressman Ron Paul... ...is now. Tonight, their fearless leader, libertarian Ron Paul. Today, Dr. Paul is all over the mainstream media. But interestingly enough... The Texas congressman comes here to the Cannon Rotunda to be interviewed. And just a few years ago, he was inundated with requests, but not from the U.S. media, but instead outlets like Al Jazeera, Press TV, and... One political reaction seems to stand out, and that's Congressman Ron Paul. He joins me today. Some politicians here, including Congressman Ron Paul, warn that America may be heading in the wrong direction as a result. And one of the things the congressman has warned about for over two decades... This, I think, is one of your favorite uh, subjects, the Federal Reserve. What do you think a potential audit of the Fed would expose? Would people be shocked uh, what goes on in this institution behind closed doors? Well, the way the Federal Reserve is fighting to keep us from finding out what they're doing, it sounds like we will be shocked. But now the Fed might not have much of a choice because the Republican congressman will be the new chairman of the Domestic Policy Subcommittee, a House panel that oversees the Federal Reserve, putting him in a tremendous position to... Use it as a, a, uh, a good oversight committee of the Federal Reserve. That means more oversight and, and move toward a true audit of the Fed. An audit and perhaps even an end to the Fed that before was unthinkable, but now... Congressman, always good to have you with us, especially on a day when they bail out the Europeans to the tune of a trillion dollars. The media isn't shying away anymore, and Paul's supporters... Already we're organizing veterans for Ron Paul 2012. Thank you! And Paul's supporters are as optimistic much. as ever. It's really not just about Ron Paul, but the rise of the movement that's behind him that is based on the philosophy of liberty and the ideas of liberty. As far as the government and the press? Right now, they're sort of waking up. Dina Gosofsky, RT, Washington, D.C.